What is up guys? I am Ryan, your tech guy with the Click Experts, and we specialize in internet marketing, software development, and on-site technical support with your networks. Hey guys, how you guys doing today? Uh, this is Ryan with the Click Experts. Today we're going to go ahead and try to take a look at our fiber fox. And this is a thermal fiber stripper. And this model is the TS Plus from Fiber Fox. Really handy tool. So let's go ahead and take a look at how it works. Okay. So good tool here, um, has a nice weight to it, good battery life. Manufacturer says it can do up to 500 strips on one battery life, which is good. The only problem I run into uh, doing it manually is it takes a, a ton of time and you don't actually get your strands all to the same length every time. So that's where this tool really comes in handy. Every single one of your potentially terminations, when you strip it with a thermal fiber stripper, it just basically allows you to uh, get those all at the same length, uh, which is nice. It's hard to do when you strip it manually. Uh, so I'll go ahead and uh, let's strip some out manually. And we'll go ahead and take a look at how hard that is. And then we'll compare that to our Fiber Fox Thermal Stripper. Okay, so this is OM5 Multimode Fiber <clears throat> Armored. I'll just cut out this armor. Get down to our strands. I'll have to go through one more jacket. Okay, so that was just removing some of this and we usually polish that off, tape it off, make sure there's no sharp edges. And we'll just do a light score here and try to see if that was enough. Uh, go ahead and collect the aramid yarn. That's everything in this yellow. We'll just cut it off for now. Careful not to nick your strands. I know you got some of you guys have seen me do this before. <clears throat> okay, we'll set that over there. Yeah, so you know, normally when you have to begin your process of termination, we're down to the strands now, but at this point, we would have to remove this jacketing and um, we have some other cool tools we'll show you guys on our, our kits from Amazon. Um, these are just standard fiber stripping tool. Two slots. The main slot is down here. And uh, usually if you wanted to do it, you'd have to get a bite on it. I usually get a bite. I just try to pull from the back. Oh, sometimes it breaks. That's the problem. But yeah, I usually... I mean, it's... It's tough. It's tough to get this off without breaking the inside fiber. So I usually get it about there and then I'll pull it off and we're down to our fiber. And then as another step you'd have to do is you have to line it up in this V groove. Line it up perfect. And then you have to strip off the glue. And there's your glue. So anyhow, that's you know the process you have to go through manually with this stuff and sometimes you'll get things that just come out to different lengths I'll dispose of this you gotta be careful with this stuff always dispose of it it is considered hazardous hazardous waste so I'm gonna set that aside all right so let's take a look at the fiber fox ts pro 
Uh, we have two windows here. Keep in mind, this is sold separately. This is the holder for the fiber. So if you're buying this tool, make sure you realize these are sold separately. Okay. So the way this works is you kind of just get a, we'll use the orange strip so you guys can see it better. You kind of just get a general feel for how long this thing is. So if you look at it here, we would want to kind of have it grabbed here because obviously it can't be too long. So just give yourself a general idea of where to put it in the holder. This is a magnetic door. You gotta pull pretty hard to open this guy. Okay. And we know our marks here, so we'll try to get in that general range to load the strand into the tool. Okay, so now we're loaded. Uh, this is magnetic to this surface, so it'll stick. So you can just stick it on there and make sure you're forward. You can see we're pretty close to that end. Okay, we'll turn the tool on just by holding. Okay, it'll come up in safe mode. One more click and we go into heater. And now we're basically ready to just close these doors and hold down. And we're looking for this light to beep. And it's beep, that means it's heated up to the right temperature and you pull. Okay, so all in that step, we've basically, look the, the coatings melting off there. All in one step, we've taken the, this outer jacketing off and we've stripped off all that Acrylite glue that was on there all in one step. So at this point, we'd be ready to load this into our cleaver, get a nice cut on it. And it just gives you a consistency you can't really get with any other uh, manual method of doing this. You can get all your fibers to come out exactly the same length. And uh, obviously this saves a lot of time. So yeah, check this tool out, you guys. I hope you guys like this video. Uh, remember to like, share, subscribe, and we'll see you on the next one. Uh, if you enjoyed this product and you want to maybe purchase it for yourself, go ahead and hit the link in the description. Thanks so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed the content or you learned something, please give us a like, a comment, a subscribe. Again, this is Ryan with the Click Experts, your tech guy, signing off. watching. Also, thank you to all those who subscribe and donate.